Hello everybody. I'm just wanting to make a quick video about testing the gap power of a an LS coil. Um, I've got a test coil right here and then I got two coil packs over there where I removed all of them. This is the square one. Those are the round ones. I don't know if that makes a difference. I know there's some debate about, oh, get the ones that got the heat sinks on them and blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Anyway, um, it's for a, a mega squirt, micro squirt, uh, Cobra project that I will, that I'm putting the cart way before the horse on, but it's an EFI swap. And for the fuel injection, I would do coil near plug ignition as well. But you buy all these used coils and from the, from the pick and pay and, uh, I want to test them. So these coils have an internal feature where um, you don't need a coil driver. You can just send it a logic level signal. Well, they get 12 volts, which is three 18650s in series. And there's my 12 volt tap feeding 12 volts to the coil. No, wait, scratch that. This is the 12 volts because it's four, eight, 12 volts. They're fully charged. But this is the 12 volts, and it feeds the 12 volt side of the coil. And then it's, um, you can find the connectors, pin out A, B, C, and D. The two on one end, I forget if it's A and B or C and D, but they're both grounds. One of them goes to cylinder head ground, and one of them goes to uh, ECM ground. For testing purposes, they're both grounded, and they're stuffed under an alligator clip right here. And then right next to it, I've got the secondary side of the coil alligator clip coming up here and it's just held really close. You'll see a spark gap in a second. Then what you do, the reason I wanted 18650s is so I could tap off four volts right here. That is my signal that goes to this purple. So the coil gets 12 volts constantly, but when the ECU sends a five volt signal, in my case four, to the signal wire, which it's different color on every coil, and this one just so happens to be purple, that's what fires the coil. So you don't need a driver, a coil driver, like you used to need on old like HEI or distributor style coils. So basically, I'm going to touch these two and pow. You can hold it, but I don't want to burn out the coil. People are making these fancy 555 timer things. Eh, I just wanted to see the spark jump. Anyway, later.